And today I will show you how to make the ivory dart or the small dart with potato masala. So all ingredients you need are, come on guys. So guys, uh, here we will start with the ingredients. I have oil for cooking. Then I have taken one teaspoon of dira. One tablespoon of dhania powder, that's coriander powder. Salt according to taste. Garam masala, one teaspoon. Chili powder, red chili powder according to taste. Turmeric powder, one fourth of a teaspoon. Ginger garlic paste, this is mixed paste. I'm using two tablespoons. Uh, you can even log on to my videos to see how to make homemade ginger garlic paste. Then here I have two medium or little bit large sized potatoes. Chopped. So guys, I, as I told you, here I have the potatoes, two potatoes chopped in this uh, style or this shape. Then three to four tomatoes, medium size, chopped in a large slice, as you can see here, roughly chopped. Then here I have the ivory guard or the small guards. This is approximately 500 grams. Onions, 250 grams. Now, uh, we'll start with our preparations. So now we'll be taking oil in the pan. Once the oil is hot, first I'll be adding the chopped onions. That is 250 grams of onions, which are chopped finely. And I will stir fry them till they become slightly golden brown. So guys, once your onions get golden brown, as you can see, we'll be adding the spices, that's the ginger garlic paste. We'll be adding approximately 2 tablespoons of ginger garlic paste. And stir fry it till it leaves the raw aroma. Right. Then uh, keep the onions aside so that it releases oil in the middle. Then we'll be adding the zira powder, that's the cumin powder. Dhania powder, that's coriander powder. Garam masala. Chili according to your taste, red chili powder. Then turmeric powder. Stir fry nicely in oil. Once you get the nice aroma, we'll be mixing it in the onions and just stir fry for some time. Once you get the nice aroma of the spices, So guys, I am getting nice aroma of all the masalas in it. Now I will be adding the tomatoes. Start. So guys, uh, once you add the tomatoes, uh, if you see the thing is too dry, we can go ahead and add a bit of water to avoid the masala from burning. And we will uh, just mix it well and close the lid till the tomatoes turn into soft ones. And see that the volume of the flame gas is on medium flame so that it doesn't burn the masala. So guys, once you see your tomatoes are soft and tender, now we'll be adding the, masala, the, the small guards or the ivory guards into it. So guys, once you add the small guard, see that you mix it nicely in the masala and oil and stir fry and cook them on medium flame for approximately 5 minutes so that they nicely get fused up with the masala or the oil. Start. So guys, uh, you will nicely stir fry the masala and the small guards in the pan. And then we'll keep it on sim and close the lid and in, in, in terms of time we'll be just stirring it in order that it doesn't catch it at the bottom. If you find it's too dry, you can go ahead and sprinkle water, uh, water whenever you uh, stir fry it if you need water. So guys, uh, once your masala is nicely prepared, I've added a bit of water. When your uh, small guards are half done or 75% done, that time you add little bit of water and we will be adding the potatoes. 
the reason why i added water is so that your potatoes get cooked fast as i added a nice large amount of uh, water so that the potato will get cooked remember guys when uh, 60% to 70% of the cards have been done guards have been done the little guards or the ivy guards that's the point where we will add the potatoes as the potatoes get cooked fast we'll mix them well and again we will close the lid and and in intervals of time we'll be stirring it so that it doesn't catch at the bottom now i'll be closing the lid over it uh, so guys once you once you feel that your potatoes have done completely i'll be adding sugar i'm adding sugar cube you can add granulated sugar also sugar is optional guys i want the sweet and uh, a uh, yummy taste in it so i'll be adding sugar once you add sugar mix all the ingredients well and uh, you feel that the masala is leaving sides and oil this is the time where you can uh, plate it out or dish it out so here i'll take a bowl you feel that the masala is leaving its side oil I uh, will be dishing it out. Dishing it out, as I told you, I garnished it with some seasoned sesame seeds, sesame seeds. And here, guys, we have the yummy, yummy small uh, gourd or the ivory gourd with potato masala. 